Come back. Are you okay? Tara. <laughs> I mean, it's season four. It's bigger and better. I think it. I think it is our best season yet, actually. Um, and there's some incredible surprises. I wanted to surprise you. <laughs> you did. <laughs> yes, I did. Especially if you want to see what's up with Tara. She's been up to some stuff. Just to see sort of what all the characters have been doing and where we go with that. Where have you been? Is sort of wild and crazy fun. I mean, when you've got vampires and witches and other supernatural powers, it's bound to be tense and something's bound to go wrong. <laughs> and that's what makes it true blood and that's what makes it so much fun to watch. I got your text. So I came by to see Sook. I think a lot of people are kind of tired of seeing Tara be the victim. And I think, you know, this fourth season coming up, I think we're going to get to see a new Tara that's sort of found her feet. I think she's a lot more stable. She's had some time to think about some things and, you know, ultimately she's going to be swept up into a world that she never even thought possible. Come on, we're late. We gotta go. Yeah, I've been telling people she gets some power. Not like it's necessarily a superpower, but she's got power in herself. It's sort of like Tara from season one is back a little bit. You know, we kind of got that, some of the sassiness going on and I think that's going to be a lot of fun. I didn't know you could cook. I never made breakfast for you. But with Sam, whenever they got really close and uncomfortable, she was out the door. And I think Tara was in love with Sam, actually. I just think she wasn't ready for it. I think, you know, we did leave a little bit unresolved with the two of them uh, in the third season. So I think in the fourth season, that will be dealt with. And we will sort of find out what's going to happen with the two of them. Seriously? You a wicked now? Hope that you're going to come away. I guess so.